Hey everyone, Flanker Jack here, and as you can see, I'm all dressed up here on a lazy Sunday here. I wanted to give you a quick rundown of the Plat Attack Peacekeeper Mark V that I've been running for about six months now. I got a question from a viewer just to see how it fits on somebody. So here I am. Uh, for size reference, I'm about six foot. I'm a good 250 pounds right now. Way to go. Thanksgiving. But I just wanted to show how this fits. Now, obviously, take this off here for a second. Now, going back to the features, it's a full-size chest rig. It's made by Plat Attack, which is an Australian company that makes gear for the military. If you're familiar with them, you might see them on a lot of European airsoft videos. Um, this is excellent. And I will say that after a few months of use, running it out for large milsim events, airsoft, even just taking it out on hikes, just to test it out. This is still probably the best piece of kit I've ever bought. So you have the three magazine pouches up front. These can easily hold six magazines up to an AK mags. I did test it out with some AK mags from a friend. These flaps are adjustable and removable. So if you wanted to just put the mags in there for quick or to put in some kiwis or something like that you're more than able to you have two columns of molly i've just got pouches on there right now just for demonstration purchase it purposes so you can kind of see what's on there and then you have these fixed uh gear pouches on the side down below you do have a pretty good size uh kind of dangler semi dangler and on the back side you have a zippered map map pouch the zipper is actually removable as well you have a couple of extra storage in here and then you have a bit of velcro underneath if you wanted to attach another dangler to it so when you buy this you're going to get the x harness and an h harness so you actually get a full complete set of kit it's fully adjustable for height adjustable for any size i actually went and bought uh, they call this the yoke or the Y harness. It's it's basically a padded Molly harness, so you can put you know a Haley flat pack right here on the back, um, and this is adjustable as well to for for height. I have everything kind of set down to its lowest level, even though I like my chest rigs to run a bit higher. What I found is these these pouches might get in the way here, but it doesn't really matter. I mean, I'm still able to shoulder my weapon, manipulate my weapon as needed, switch shoulders, do all that kind of cool fun stuff. Now, as you can see, I've got my pistol right here. For maybe you smaller guys, these pouches might ride a bit more to the side. This is where I like to carry my pistol and it doesn't bother me at all. And actually during the matches or during the, the Milsim events, I had zero problem drawing my pistol and even getting to my reloads. So that's the kit right there. It's excellent i do recommend that if you're looking for that recce style chest rig go ahead and check this one out everyone's doing recce chest rigs right now everyone on the internet everyone on youtube and they are charging an arm and a leg for basically what you're going to get here now it's not cheap you're probably going to spend probably maybe close to 300 dollars for the, the harness and the the chest rig and it will take a few weeks for delivery depending on customs and getting it from australia but buy this chest rig don't go out and buy the latest and greatest from someone on youtube because you're going to be spending the same amount of money that's what i think anyway plat attack chest rig 250 pound guy this is what it looks like thanks for watching and i'll see you on the field